one of our uh, new lesson on the graphs of sine and cosine functions. Okay, so before we go to the transformation of the graph, it is but proper na pag-usapan muna natin the basic graph of a sine and a cosine function. Unahin natin yung sine function. Okay, so suppose we have the function f of x equals sine x. Okay, f of x equals sine x. What is the graph? Okay, since uh, kung titignan natin, the sine of x, the value of sine of x is in a circle. Okay, so ibig sabihin nito that the graph of uh, sine of x also with cosine of x uh, repeats every 2 pi, every revolution. Okay, ibig sabihin nito, the graph is cyclical. Okay, it goes round and round and round. So, if that is the case, ang tawag dito, uh, it's a periodic function. Okay, so meron siyang period. Ibig sabihin pa ulit-ulit yung graph niya. Okay, so for this, ano, for this case, let us create a graph. Okay, let us create a graph. And let us graph one cycle. That is from 0 to 2 pi region, one revolution. Okay, so assuming yung 2 pi region nandito. And to graph yung, ano natin, yung function natin, f of x equals sine x, we need to divide the one period into 4. Okay, so half of 2 pi is pi. And then half of pi is pi over 2 and in between pi and 2 pi that is 3 pi over 2 okay so to graph f of x equals sine x okay we need okay 1 there and negative 1 here okay so first we need to compute for the Okay, we need to compute for the values of f of x for these values of x. Una, okay, let us compute for, okay, uh, okay, sine of pi over 2. But we need this one to, to be in region. Angle unit should be in region. Okay, so sine of pi over 2. That is basically sine of 90 degrees. And 90 degrees is in the, uh, it's, a, it's a quadrantal angle. So this is 1. Okay. Uh, okay. So sine of pi over 2 is one and we miss sine of zero sine of zero is okay sine of zero is zero okay so sine of zero will be here and then sine of pi okay sine of pi sine of pi that is 180 degrees it's also zero okay and then sine of 3 pi over 2 is okay, negative 1. So it's here. And sine of 2 pi is the same as sine of 0. So it's here. And then we connect the points. Okay, so we connect the points. Assuming this is a smooth curve. Okay, so this is one cycle of the graph of f of x equals sine x. Big sabihin nito, this graph uh, will continue ano, and will repeat itself. It, it will repeat itself. Okay, so big sabihin nito, it will continue in both direction at paulit-ulit na ganyan yung graph natin. 
Ibig sabihin, we can just copy this one and then uh, pwede natin ilagay dito if there is another cycle. Okay, so, susunod dito is 5 pi over 2 and then uh, 6 pi over 2 or 3 pi and then 7 pi over 2 and then 4 pi. Okay, so we can continue with the graph and ito paulit-ulit lang, ano? Paulit-ulit lang na ganyan yung graph, eh. So, parang copy-paste lang tayo. So, cycle, ano? Nagsa-cycle siya. Okay, so the graph is a cycle. So, the graph of sine x looks like that. Like, assuming that is a smooth curve. Also, dito din sa kabila, ganun din, ano? So, it will continue just like that. So, let us ano, summarize. From 0 to pi over 2, the graph of sine x is increasing from 0 to 1. And then, from pi over 2 to pi, that is, the graph of sine x is decreasing. And then, decreasing until 3 pi over 2 to negative 1, actually. Ano? And then, increasing from 3 pi over 2 to 2 pi. Okay, so ganyan ang itsura ng f of x equals sine x. Okay. And then susunod naman, i-graph natin yung f of x equals cosine of x. Okay. So cosine naman yan. So cosine of 0, hindi na ako mag-calculator, kaya na mag-calculator. Cosine of 0 is positive 1. So nandito. Cosine of pi over 2 is 0. Cosine of pi is negative 1. Cosine of 3 pi over 2 is 0. And cosine of 2 pi is positive 1. So, ibig sabihin, the graph of uh, f of x equals cosine x uh, looks like this. Okay? So, this is also one cycle of the graph. Ibig sabihin, this can also extend and will repeat itself na parang sa sin x lang din okay. negative 1 and then pa and then 0 and then positive 1 okay so the cycle repeats the graph okay so basically the period ibig sabihin ng period yung isang cycle ng graph is 2 pi okay so the period of sin x and cosine x is 2 pi Okay, so the period is 2 pi for both sine x and cosine x. Now, on the next video, we will talk about some transformations of the graph of f of x equals sine x and cosine x.